I've gotten several emails from subscribers basically asking how do I know that I am raising my vibrations vibration is what I talk about all the time because everything has a vibratory frequency and that it is very important that as the crystals or photon energies come and permeate this planet and everything that's attached to it that we make the transition a lot more easier by doing what we have to do so that we are more in alignment with those higher frequencies and it's kind of a catch-22 because on one hand we're raising our vibrations to be high, one with these frequencies but at the same time there's a side effect to those energies whether you are consciously aware of it or not and I'll talk about that one at a later time but right now I'm going to basically share with you guys the basic bouts and proof that you are absolutely raising your vibration the first and foremost thing is that you literally feel lighter on your feet you have more energy you're a lot more alert you're vibrant and that radiates in your auric field. The second thing is you notice that your skin and hair is more healthier and uh, vibrant. You may have a very youthful appeal you may, uh, or a youthful look. You may have people telling you more than often that, hey, you look a little different. What are you doing? Are you, you getting a little extra rest or you know is there something that you're taking because you're looking a little extra special you know people have their own way of explaining that and of course uh, the physical vessel is an extension of what we feel on the inside so if you're feeling vibrant youthful and energetic on the inside it's going to show in your hair your skin in your eyes the brightness of your eyes the white will look brighter and more illuminated and clearer skin the other thing that lets you know that you're raising your vibration is that things don't really get to you as much it's almost as if you develop an immunity to BS and stress it's almost like you can walk on fire and people want some of whatever that is that you have when you walk around and seem to just have this built-in resistance towards stress and drama <laughs> and I know there's more than enough of that to go around nowadays also when we raise our vibration we seem to just know things you just know things you 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 have a connection to your inner self like in a way that you really can't explain um, you feel more of a connection to the earth your loved ones say if you have a very close friend who's going through something something may kick in and say hey call that person and unbeknownst to you this person is having a difficult time it could be a parent a sibling you become heightened in your awareness and then your knowing and, and the needs of others you want to give more and you want to do more and you start caring more about things that you hadn't much done in the past like your fellow man animals the earth you may want to get more involved in politics to change the world for the better let's see that's the gist of how we know that we're raising our vibration now this is not to say that when we raise our vibrations we won't have periods of feeling bummed out or uh, you know down it's, it's okay to have bouts of that and actually some of that may be tied to the energies those higher energies that I talk about is one of those side effects but the thing about raising your vibration is that you can have those moments but you're so resilient you never stay there you bounce back you have a level of resilience that is just undeniable and you really 
become a different person. Your thought processes are changing. People notice the change in you. You feel it inside and out. And I'm going to come back to uh, the whole vibrational shift and the side effects of that. And right now, I want to do what I love doing, and that is sharing information as it relates to people who are doing things that I feel is worthy of sharing with you guys. And that is my friend, Zachrack of the X-Men, title below. Um, my friend, very young, very wise, indigo, definitely an indigo. And what he did was come up with something very brilliant. He decided that he would create a Wicca page, kind of like Wikipedia, for astral projection. And I love the idea so much that I told him that I wanted to share it with you guys. And this is the thing. We can go there. You can sign up an account for free. You can put your information there just like Wikipedia is but this is strictly for astral projection you guys can contribute and really make it something more than special for the collective or those who are just coming into this understanding and wanting answers all of the information is below uh, I wish I could actually tie the link to this video but unfortunately the YouTube environment does not permit that so Take down the uh, web address, check it out, create an account, put your information there. You can update it. Everything is free. And as always, everybody, happy travels.